in this video, we are going to learn how to get into rest position. Rest position is the position that I'm in right now. And rest position right is what I like to call it because everything is going to be, I'm gonna turn this way so you can see as well, on the right side of your body when you're in rest position. So rest position right. You'll see that the violin is secure. It's actually kind of up in my armpit. I put my arm down and adjust it so that it fits nicely and my arm is down over the tailpiece. The scroll is at an angle. My bow is on my right pointer finger. So I take my bow with my left hand and the hair on the bow is gonna face towards my tummy, bring it across my body, put it on my hook like Captain Hook has a hook, place it there, take my thumb, place my thumb on top of the frog so I can resist the urge to swing my bow. Then my feet will be together. Let me angle it down a little bit so you can see my feet. So my feet will be together, just like this. And then at the end, when I'm done playing or practicing, I will show respect by taking a nice bow. Have I tied my shoes today? Yes, I've tied my shoes today. So let's go through our steps on how we get there to rest position. I'm gonna place my violin down. Now yours, once you've gotten it all set up with your righty tidy, rosin your bow, put your rosin back away, put your shoulder pad on, then you just sit all right back down in your open case. Then what you're going to do to get into rest position is you're gonna take your left hand and you're gonna use it like an ice cream scoop or a shovel. And you're gonna come under the neck of the violin, take the shoulders, bring it up across your body, under your arm and your armpit, angle it so it's secure. Scroll is angled and you see that it's nice and secure. I, my hands are free, I'm not holding it like this. I'm nice and relaxed. Then I take my left hand, take the stick of the bow, use that Captain Hook, which is my right pointer finger, bring the bow across my body, curve my Captain Hook, put my thumb on the frog, feet together. Have I tied my shoes today? Yes, I've tied my shoes today. So you're gonna practice those steps. Now when you get really good, you're gonna say it on your mark and set go and see how quickly you can get in rest position. Are you ready? On your mark, get set, go. See how quickly I did that? Have I tied my shoes today? Yes, I've tied my shoes today. One more time. This time I'll explain those steps quickly. Here we go. On your mark, get set, go. Scoop your shovel, left hand under. Bring the violin across your body in your armpit. Angle the scroll, arm down behind those fine tuners. Bring your bow across your body and your thumb on the frog, feet together. Okay, great. Now, when you're super or super good at this, you can put your violin one over there, maybe your bow over there, and see how quickly you can get into rest position. On your mark, get set, go. All right, that was pretty quick. And then let's end with our bow. Have I tied my shoes today? Yes, I've tied my shoes today. All right, have fun working with rest position. Next, we're going to work from rest to play. See you soon. Bye.